Hey guys, so guess where I am again? I'm at the thrift store and look what I found. So, $3.99 Harajuku Lovers G. I posted a video not too long ago um, where I found this. It was $14.99. And now they have one here <laughs> uh, for $3.99, but it's not a full bottle. This time I will get it, um, if not just for display in my house. And I do like the scent. It's a nice coconutty, vanilla, pina colada, pineapple kind of scent. Not too serious, but it's a nice scent, especially for that price. So I'm going to definitely pick this one up. I went through all of this stuff here. I saw this faraway Avon um, body powder. Um, I smelled the perfume. One of my viewers sent me a sample of it. Thank you so much. I thought it was a good scent. But this is the powder. Uh, what else did I see here? I think... Oh! I did see this. This is not... Well, kind of perfume related, but... I saw these little organizer things. There's two of them. It looks like they haven't been used at all. And you can put stuff in there. And I was thinking you can put samples in there or decants just so that they're nice and organized so that's $2.99 for that I think that's a good deal but I actually just picked some up here at the uh, thrift store to organize my samples and decants so I'm not going to need this but just an idea for those of you out there who want to organize your samples and decants so yes I will definitely pick this one up very happy about it <laughs> And um, yeah, I'll bring this home. I'll look around uh, some more, but I'll bring this home and uh, do like, I'll sniff it and see what I think about it. See if my, my thoughts have changed about it. Um, so I'll be right back. And I came across these perfumes here. So the first one here is Old Spice, classic cologne, eau de cologne. It feels full and it's $1.99 for that because uh, I know it's a classic and um, I did smell it a long time ago my, my dad actually used to wear it and uh, I think it's a really nice scent <laughs> so just a second guys the next thing that I saw here is the Swiss Army Eau de Toilette $3.99 and this one is about a quarter or less than a quarter full so so the next one here is Peck Sniffs England Men's Charismatic Tarragon Lime Musk Body Spray so looks like this is from Winners or Marshalls $6.99 and they're selling it for $3.99 and finally, I'll probably pass on that one. I'm not sure yet. <laughs> finally, we have this uh, scent, Voyageur Eau de Toilette for Homme by Jean Pertou. This is $3.99 and the level is right here. Uh, no idea what this is about. I don't know, it kind of looks like an older bottle, like a vintage thing. I might get it just for fun. We'll see. <laughs> uh, I'll keep looking around to see if I find anything else. Um, but that's so far what I see at the thrift store. Hey guys, so now I'm home. This is what I picked up. I passed on the other stuff mainly because the ones that I thought were semi-interesting, the Old Spice and then the Jean Poitou one, they were both splash bottles and I'm kind of scared. Well, I'm not sure if it's safe. I, actually, I, yeah, it's probably not safe to put things on your skin or test things that um, can be contaminated like that. Whereas with spray bottles, you know, it's not like anyone can tamper with it likely not anyways uh, so i left those behind and this is one that i picked up the harajuku lovers g this one was only 3.99 which is weird because when i saw it um, earlier some time ago it was 14.99 but this one is not full you can see here it's about 
I'm not sure if it's showing, but mm, there we go. Less than half. <laughs> uh, so I already own this fragrance. It was one of my earliest purchases when I was younger, uh, some years ago. And um, it is just the cutest bottle here. Let me just rip this open first. Uh, $3.99 plus tax. Fantastic deal. There's the bottle. Um, they have such cute bottle designs. There are so many flankers or different fragrances in this collection. And I honestly wouldn't mind just collecting them because of how adorable they are. <laughs> um, so this one is 30 mil. And um, I'll be giving this to a friend of mine who likes the design and since I already have one. So I know what this one is all about already. The one concern I have is maybe it's off, um, but we'll see here. Let me just spray it on here. Okay, so Harajuku Lovers G. Mm, I think it went off. <laughs> yeah, it has like this very sharp, almost chemical astringent medicinal blast in the beginning here so that's unfortunate but at least you'll have something nice to display I guess with this cute bottle but I do remember what this is supposed to smell like I've had my bottle um, for a long long time um, let me just read out the notes to this one this is obviously Harajuku Lovers uh, Gwen Stefani line. The main accords with this one are coconut, sweet, lactonic, tropical, vanilla, powdery, and nutty. And then it was released in 2008. And then I'll just read out the notes for those of you who like hearing about that. The top notes are coconut, red apple, and mandarin orange. Middle notes are jasmine, freesia, and magnolia. And the base notes are cotton flower and sandalwood. So to me, with my memory of this fragrance, this one to me smells very coconutty and very pineapple-y or pineapple-ish. <laughs> so it does to me remind me of a pina colada. I'm surprised that there aren't any pineapple notes in this one because that's what this fragrance smells like to me, like a fresh, freshly made Pina Colada, very refreshing, summery, super fun. There's some sweetness in here that I'm picking up on, adding to that fruity sweetness, maybe some vanilla. So I'm kind of making my own <laughs> pyramid with this one. Um, but this to me is definitely a uh, Pina Colada scent. Heavy on the coconut. The, heav uh, the coconut does overpower everything else with this fragrance. Um, it also has this waxy character. Sometimes when I think of coconut and when it's creamed, um, it kind of reminds me of candle wax a little bit, or maybe a pina colada scented candle. But it is such a fun fragrance. It's easy to wear. It's not that serious. It's just such a cute little thing <laughs> that I adore. Um, I don't wear this anymore, but I do enjoy um, the bottle design here and it's kind of a shame that they discontinued this collection. Um, I'm pretty sure there would be several people who would like to collect these cute bottles. But yeah, it's the second time that I saw it at their thrift store. And yeah, this one is a nice pleasant scent, but uh, discontinued and for $3.99 even though it's gone bad <laughs> as I said earlier it would be a nice little display piece for sure so that was my video for today I hope you guys enjoyed it please let me know in the comments what you think of the scent and maybe if you have a favorite Harajuku lovers fragrance um, I'd love to hear about that too um, thanks again and I'll see you next time bye bye